All right, so now we're going to work on some expanding, all right? Now make sure the expansion, um, when we're applying expansion, okay, um, make sure that if the expansion happens when we have a product, we can rewrite as the addition. Again, we can only expand when we have the product of a logarithm, we can rewrite as the addition of multiple logarithms. So here you can see the only product that I have is 7 times 2x minus 3 squared. All right, I understand that I'm subtracting these, but that does not tell me to use this property because it's not a logarithm subtracting another logarithm. All right, this is just the subtraction of, it, um, of two terms. It's not a subtraction of with two logarithms. So we can't apply any properties of logarithms within the parentheses. But I do see a product between 7 and 2x minus 3 squared. So therefore, I can rewrite that as log base 3 of 7 plus log base 3 of 2x minus 3 squared, right? By applying this rule, I can now do that. And now, the last step is I take my exponents, and I can rewrite those in front by applying this property of logarithm. So therefore, my final expanded expression is log base 3 of 7 plus 2 log base 3 of 2x minus 3. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you expand a logarithmic expression. Thanks. Hello.